<laughs> hey, beautiful souls. Hopefully this is going to work. Um, I'm on my phone. I was going to try to take you guys on a little walk with me, but I was getting too far from my internet and um, you know how that is. So I, I apologize for having glasses. I'll try to do it without. Um, the sun is so beautiful today that I just uh, wanted to go for a little walk and wanted to take you guys with me. Um, as you may know, uh, I'm just back from an amazing trip. <clears throat> and so that really got me thinking when I was gone about um, relationships, the relationships we have, how we foster them, and how they help to feed us and nourish us and nurture us and help us grow, right? Uh, and then that made me think about, you know, I was on vacation with my best friend. We've been friends for uh, like more than 26 years, so a really long time. Um, but really, I was thinking about, um, hey, Alec, you guys can hear me okay? I think that's what that means. Let me know. Uh, so, I, you know, I was thinking about, okay, we have these relationships with other people, but what about our relationships with ourselves? Because so many of you have told me, you know, through private messages when you're joining the Joy Soul Spa Facebook group and you fill out the questionnaire so I can better help you and serve you. So many of you have told me things like, I don't trust my intuition or I, I don't know when it's my intuition or when it's my anxiety or um, I, I don't know what are the right decisions for myself or I don't know if I can feel my own guidance or my guides or my loved ones. And all of these things I've learned over the years come back to our relationship with ourselves, being able to trust ourselves. And if you think about it, we don't, I mean, we spend all day with ourselves, right? But how often are we really recognizing who we are? It's it's not just, I mean, you may say like, I know my likes and dislikes, I know myself, but really you're not just this present version of yourself. We are all, you know, made up of all of our experiences that we've ever had our whole lifetime. We are um, containing all of the younger versions of ourselves, um, all of the timelines of <clears throat> interactions and traumas and joys and lessons and all of that within us. Um, so we're all of those things. And then in addition, we're a soul. So that means we are all of the wisdom um, that our soul contains from this lifetime, from the soul's blueprint, right, that we came in with. The um, Mavis Patilla used to call it uh, the, the maker's plan, you know, our creator's plan, the divine plan for us is our soul knows all of that information. Our soul knows information from every lifetime we've ever had, every experience we've ever had. So that's all in here too. And that is the bigger part of us than our, you know, human personality. Um, so knowing ourself means so much more than just knowing our likes and dislikes, you know, our favorite color, our favorite food. Um, it means knowing and understanding our own soul's plan as it's unfolding. It means knowing um, what's best for us over someone else. And while you guys know I believe community is so important, I think we need a balance of relationship building with ourselves and with community. Uh, it's funny that I was thinking about all this on the plane, actually, um, on my way back. And, you know, I was really just thinking that how, how fortunate is it? I mean, you, spirit times things so perfectly all the time. I feel like how perfect is it that we have the free live workshop coming up on Monday in the Joy Soul Spa Facebook group. You're all invited if you're not already a group member, just in the groups of Facebook search Joy's Soul Spa. Come and find me. Um, Alex said he really needed to hear this today. Good. Hey, Michael. So true. Loving hearing this. Good. And Michael's a part of our community too. Um, lots of love to you. Uh, and you know, just really understanding that this opportunity is perfect timing. So if you are someone that has ever felt disconnected from that soul version of yourself, disconnected, I don't even know what's in the background of my front porch, y'all. So, so sorry if it's looking crazy back here. Um, 
uh, you know, if you're someone that's ever felt disconnected from, you know, if you have a choice to make and you don't know which directions for you, or you feel like you can't get intuition about what you need in a relationship or, or what your ideal path is, or um, even just feeling like you're in the flow and aware of synchronicities, or maybe you're someone that wants to connect with loved ones in the spirit world, you know, knowing what energy is yours and what's theirs, or maybe you're someone that's a sensitive, an empath, right? And you can feel or sense other people's emotions. And sometimes that feels really taxing for empaths because we're feeling, you know, that person's stress next to us and this person's sadness over there and that person's overwhelm. And if we haven't trained ourselves to know ourselves deeply, we kind of feel those energies as our own and it can throw off our whole day. Um, so, you know, sometimes that's why sensitives tend to be a little bit aloners too, because we can feel a lot of energy. Um, but if you learn how to manage all that and more deeply know and understand yourself, you can experience connection in a way that you don't need to feel um, uncertain, like you need to go outside of yourself. And you will know that if you do feel uncertain, it's an indication of, okay, I need to come back to me. Um, if you come to the workshop, I'll give you a set of tools that you can use forever to do that. Uh, some of it is personal development, to be quite honest. We all have things. Like I said, we all have younger versions of ourselves within us that still have a voice. So sometimes when we're experiencing a feeling of like, oh, I don't want to do that. It's not because this version of us doesn't want to do it. It's because 12 year old Joy is scared and um, was super bullied and is afraid to put herself out there because she knows what happened then, you know? So it's discerning, oh, is that my current voice that doesn't want to do that? Or is that a younger version of me that's stepping up to try to protect me? Um, or out of fear, you know, or is that a guidance that I'm receiving from my soul? Is that is that intuition? Um, and so the tools that we're going to learn this next week will help you with all of that. And they're tools that you can use forever. Um, so I just think it's perfect timing. Uh, and I know Spirit always kind of orchestrates things with really good timing. So if you want to come to that workshop, it's totally free. Um, just head on over to the Joy Soul Spa Facebook group. It's going to be live there every day starting next Monday, April 10th at noon Pacific, which is 3 p.m. Eastern. But don't worry if you can't make the lives because the replays will be in the group for about a week. I'll leave them up so you can practice the tools. Um, I'm going to teach you, uh, you know, this foundational, um, essential tool that every professional psychic and medium I know uses. <laughs> so I'm going to teach it to you. People are often shocked that I teach this one, um, but we all need it. And, and it's, it's so easy. Anyone can do it. Uh, it takes some practice, but anyone can do it. I'm going to teach you how to get clear sign about, um, any issue that you have in your life for yourself, uh, you know, and, and how to practice that in your own world. I'm going to teach you how to connect with a loved one in the spirit world. I'm going to teach you how to get to the bottom of anything that you feel like is blocking you. Like, you know, we all sometimes feel like things aren't flowing or things aren't moving or we don't know which way to go for short periods of time. Um, this tool is like a maintenance for you to continue to do with yourself to deepen that connection with yourself in relationship with your own self like we were talking about uh, and with your own soul. And those younger versions of you will get some healing too. Um, we will ultimately do a healing session. We've got the free community healing coming up. That's going to be Tuesday. I'm going to do it as part of this at noon Pacific, 3 Eastern. But like I said, the replays will be there. Everything's going to be live in the group. So all you have to do is um, get in the group and watch for the sessions. It's going to be really fun. I've changed the way I'm doing things this time. Uh, you know, I get re-inspired too. And as the world evolves and changes, we need different things and different things work. And so um, I've adjusted it a little bit too. And I actually was in meditation before I left um, with a, a, a soul that was visiting me and got a totally new version of one of the meditations um, for the personal development. So I'm so excited to share that. I haven't shared it yet with anyone. I'm really excited. Um, they gave me that experience and, and kind of walked me through how to guide you guys through it. And so I'm, I'm going to give that to you too. Um, so I hope you will make it. Uh, I'm really excited um, to start just the more of us that can, you know, just live in an intuitive way and um, be at peace within ourselves, the, the, you know, the more it raises the vibration of our whole world. And we definitely, we definitely need that. Um, but it just makes your own life so much more vibrant, so much more um, 
connected. You know, when we feel disconnected, uh, it can just feel kind of flat. We can feel alone. It can feel isolating. But when you know how to make that connection with, you know, your, your higher self, the universe, the, the spirit around you, the spirit world, um, it really just makes things, I don't know, just a little bit more colorful. So that is what we're going to learn uh, this week. So live every day for five days in the Joy Soul Spa Facebook group. Um, those videos are not getting posted anywhere else. So if you're watching me now on YouTube or on the main, uh, my, my like Facebook business page at Joyful Medium, um, the lessons won't be there. I only post them in the Joy Soul Spa group. I'm live in there uh, every day at noon Pacific, 3 Eastern, starting Monday the 10th all the way through Friday. Um, and then depending how everyone's doing, we might do some um, live mini readings on the weekend. So you're not going to want to miss out on those. So I'm glad you guys are all telling me in the comments that you really needed this message today. I'm happy. Um, I'm happy Spirit moved me to do it. Uh, and sometimes I get out of my own way and listen to so <laughs> big hugs, lots of love. Uh, I hope you guys will take advantage of the tools um, for yourself. Uh, like I said, it's totally free, uh, no obligation of any kind. So um, those of you, if you watch this live or on the replay, those of you that have been in the free live workshops before, uh, let everyone know if you would, um, those that are new, because I know sometimes we see a lot of like, you know, free workshops and stuff that aren't really teaching anything. This really teaches. Um, so holla those of you that have been in them before there's a lot of you um just drop some hearts or, or let people know you've done it before and you know how you enjoyed it or if you didn't you could say that too <laughs> i hope to see so many of you there um big hugs you guys are so welcome thank you for being here with me lots of love um, i'm gonna go for my walk now uh, and walk out some of this vacation talk to you later big hugs bye for now